Hello guys and welcome back. Uh, we're going to be playing a game called FNAF Halloween Maze Game. Use headphones to enjoy the music. First, I'm going to tell you, yeah, you should not turn caffeine all day when you are on tremor medication and try to play a maze game at 1 in the morning. And two, you shouldn't try to record it the first two times when you're going through it because uh, you will sound like Markiplier having a raging game. But we're going to play this because I want to bring it to you because I know a lot of you have like younger brothers and sisters or if you're adults you have, you know, real little kids or maybe you just enjoy maze games yourself no matter what age you are. So here we go. Um, hover over the start region to start. So you're going to hover here. And hopefully this is lit and you see my cruiser. So if I am giving you play by play and you can see the cruiser and you wonder what I'm doing, um, first time I recorded this, it would not do it. So, I am going up past the jack o lanterns face, and I have to try to stay within the, the white lines. And it is a lot harder than it sounds, especially if you have tremors. But the nice thing is, it kind of teaches you finesse, so it's not just for little kids. It's for adults or anyone that needs to work on hand-eye coordination. So if you kind of are like doing rehab and you want to kind of try to work on your finesse and your motor skills, really great game. When you are getting up um, towards his ear now, when you're getting up towards his ear, you can't touch the text, you can't touch the ear, you can't touch the red line. So this is a really hard part. This is really, really hard, and this is one of the hardest games I've played, FNAF fan games, even though it's a little kid's game, because, okay, you've passed the ear, and we're trying to get past the hat, because, okay, past the other ear, um, if you make it through this maze, and this is really hard, getting past the little point of the hat, uh, and you get into the next maze, if you spaz out on the next maze, you have to begin the whole way from this maze and make it the whole way through again. So really challenging game here, guys. So let's keep on going. Going past the hat and um, that's it. If you're like me and you have tremors and you feel your tremors starting to take over, just take a little break. Because if you hit anything, you start over, all over again. It's like um, a game designed by perfectionists. It's okay if the back part of your mouse or your pointer drags out of the maze, but you don't want the front part dragging on. So we're going past this fur. You can go as fast as you want, you just can't leave the maze. We're back past the so or shoulder and we're going to hit the end. Okay, now we have um, hover over the start region to start, so we see someone is scaring Freddy or one of the Freddies. So start looks deceptively simple. I have already lost this space. So let's be careful. Nice wide start path. Just be careful again if you've got tremors or any other kind of disability or motor, you know motor function problem. Just be careful. Take your time. There's no time limit on these. So you don't have to go real fast. Okay, I'm past the bunny. I'm in between. I'm near the emotion. A little cry sign. I don't want to hit that sort of... It's orange on my screen. I don't want to hit that and I don't want to hear hit his emotion sign. Okay, past his ear. Okay. Okay, going down past the hat. I don't want to go too fast because... Yeah, see, when I start to go too fast, my hands wibble wobble. Okay, if I want to go through Blue Boy Maze, I have to go and hit Start. So let's hit Start. I haven't tried this one yet, so it's pretty darn challenging. Yeah, because it's got a really narrow neck here to start. So, woo. Let's go up. Get to the end, stay on the white. Ugh, okay. I don't think I'm gonna get this one, guys. Okay, going up, going past the first, first 
Thank you. I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it. Oh my god. How do I do this? Uh, oh, you left the white path. Try again? No, I'm not gonna try again because we did a lot of it. So, um, what I'm gonna do here... Sorry about that. I bumped it. Uh, what I'm gonna do here is I'm going to, um... Leave off the recording here, and if you like what you see, like, comment, and subscribe. And if you like the game, I'll give you a link over. I like this game not just for little kids, but for anyone that likes puzzle mazes, anyone that likes Halloween. And if you need the practice with your hand-eye coordination, or you just need um, practice with a stylus, I'm using a mouse, so I don't have a stylus in the tablet or anything. But if you want to get some practicing, go ahead. Um... Not really fond of the music, but it's okay. Uh, and the pictures are really cute. The art's cute. So uh, I'll give you guys a link over, and uh, happy Halloween season to you guys, and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.